Hey, y'all, what's up? It's your boy Blair and my man, Tom. All right, check it out. If you're new, please hit the like button, subscribe button, and notification bell. So every time I put out a video, you'll be notified. And if you enjoy my content, please share. And please smash that like button. All right? Okay, here we go. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, I want to talk about how I don't think New Year's resolutions, you know, are good. I don't. I think it's some cliched bullshit. You know what I'm saying? You know, um, if you really want to do something and you make up in your mind that you want to do something or change certain aspects of your life, whether it's minimal or something huge, you know, do it. Do it. You know, when people are sick and tired of being sick and tired, that's when people change. People don't change a lot of the times with New Year's resolutions. They don't. It's backed up by stats. Here we go. The Forbes Health One Poll survey found that the average resolution lasts just 3.74 months. Only 8% of respondents tend to stick with their resolutions goals for one month, while 22% last two months, 22% last three months, and 13% last four months. Now, that's just one survey. Just one survey. You know, I'm going to tell you something. You know, uh, people change by themselves and for themselves. You know, you know, whether it's some kind of addiction or something like that, or uh, a habit that they have because your habits are what um, decides what your destiny is, you know, on whether you're going to make your goals or not. It's the small habits, you know, um, I can read you off a lot of more stats, but you know, it's boring to me. Um, but I can tell you something, every New Year's resolution that I've um, told myself, I didn't. I didn't keep up with it. I stopped about two to maybe four or five months in. Why? Because my mind was not made up. You see what I'm saying? The only for certain times that I have changed for good in my life is when I put myself in environments that helped me change when i started to read books and started to do research and get myself around people who helped me change you know um here we are we're coming to the end of 2023 you know and you got all kinds of people out there you know setting uh new year's goals or New Year's resolutions and stuff like that. And the stats show that nine times out of 10, they're not gonna finish them, you know? Why? Because they're not made up. Their mind is not made up. They're not sick and tired of being sick and tired. You see what I'm saying? So I think it's, it's bullshit. I mean, it's good, it's positive to think like that. It's new year, you know, and uh, it's a new start. But every day is a new start. Why do you gotta wait till the end of the year? Start now. You know what you have to do. You can do it. You know, you can do it. Just make up in your mind and decide that this is it. You know, can you look at yourself in the mirror right now and say that you're proud of what you see physically and mentally? Can you? Can you honestly look yourself 
in the mirror and say that you are proud of you, what you see. I know I can't. Certain parts of me I can, but certain parts I can't. You know, why? Because those things in which I can't, it's because I have it made up in my mind that this is it. You see what I'm saying? I'm just being real, 100 with you. You know, um, the way that you change is like I said, is by changing your habits. Your habits will dictate your success, period. End of story. You feel me? One way on top of changing your habits to change your life is to look at everything that you have made a significant change in growth in your life. And remember back to the mindset that you were in that made you make that change for good. Just remember, think about it. Think about it right now, think about it. And whatever drove you to that success will absolutely drive you to the next success. It'll drive you to the next success, period. You know, I'm proud of you. You know what I'm saying? You can do it. You know, don't let your habits overpower you. You know, don't let your bad habits overpower you. Change now, don't wait to the end of the year. You see what I'm saying? I wanna thank everybody for watching. This is Blair and Momentum. Remember to smash that like button and share, all right? Remember, you can't gain momentum without traction. I'm out.